In another development, Kwaibum House of Assembly has urged the state government to reinforce the ban on motorcyclists plying areas like Waniba, Oron Road and other unauthorized roads in the Uyo metropolis. The resolution was reached following a motion raised by the member representing Mpareni State constituency, Uem Imoita, on the need to prosecute motorists who operate outside the assigned areas. Imoita argued that the uncontrolled rate of motorcycle operations within major areas in Uyo has also contributed to the crime rate, while urging relevant law enforcement agents in collaboration with the State Ministry of Transport to reinforce the ban. Also note that as a measure to cut crimes and to find sustainable labor room within the state's capital city, the private state government had once placed a ban on motorcycles from flying major roads in New York. Former aware of the efforts of some motorcyclists who have been law abiding in operating within the visible areas as authorized by the Ampire uh, State Government. Worrying of the non-challenged attitude of the voters who trade on impunity by deliberately applying these on unauthorized areas using their motorcycles even in broad daylight. Members representing Ibionoibom and Ibesiko Asutun state constituencies supporting the motion noted that proper sensitization should be given to motorcyclists as well as their assigned areas of operation. What we live in in Nigeria as a whole is proper sensitization. The streets that we are polluted, then people don't even use safety apparatus. No so what we need is proper sensitization. After further deliberations on the motion, Speaker of the House, Udome Otong, directed the clerk to write to the state governor, Umueno, on the need to reinforce the ban and instruct relevant agencies to ensure strict compliance. And therefore, as a clerk, to Grand His Excellency, most especially for the resolution number one, all the governor parts of Mohasi and the direct the Honorable Commissioner for Transport, in conjunction with the security chief and the Commissioner of Police, to reactivate this order, and the order should be prosecuted in accordance with the extant law. Those in terms of Sahara, those are 